and everything on your resume is you. That's everything good, that's everything bad. So you are instantly kind of simplified into a one page sheet of paper. Quantify everything. Uh, quantifying is one of those things that people rarely know how to do well. Everything that can be measured and turned into a number on a resume, we want that thing into a number. And we want to turn it to the biggest number as we possibly can. I have three categories of questions, right? I have questions on the position, the company, and personal questions. Questions are important because recruiters want to hire people that want to work for them. So if you have no questions, you must not want to work for them very bad if you think you know everything just by reading the description. It is extremely important that you realize that we look at personalities and that weighs a great deal in an organization. Because if I have a team of six people, not only do you have to work with me, I have to worry about whether or not you get along with my other five team members. So the STAR method starts off the situation or task uh, would tell us what the problem is. Is first, uh, what did you do? What was the action? And last but not least, what's the result? Or how is the company, the organization, the situation, how is it better as a result of whatever it is you did? So the goal of this presentation here today is to kind of give you everything to not only step up and make you good, but to also make you better, because that's actually how you get the job.